Beloved, institutionalized white supremacy doesn't need your help. Stop going around saying that so-called black people enslaved their own and sold their own. This too is a narrative that is a part of the black history narrative that was created by institutionalized white supremacy. This narrative is used with psychological warfare to divide and conquer the masses. Once they start looking at themselves in the mirror for a brief moment, they didn't like the ugliness that they were seeing. So the old antics goes like this, misery loves company and it would benefit institutionalized white supremacy more if the masses of people believe that so-called black people sold their own people into slavery. It would profit and benefit institutionalized white supremacy that the masses are walking around here now thinking, believing that so-called black people are racist and architects of racism as the definition goes of racist. A racist is someone or a group of people that owned and controlled another person or a group of people. So-called black people has never owned or controlled their own people or so-called white people. Racism, by definition, is an institution where this group or body of people owned or controlled this dynamic or body of people. Again, so-called black people has never, ever, in 4,759 years, been the architects, the leaders, the managers, the presidents, the overseers, of the institution of slavery anywhere in this world. So again, let us stop giving power to institutionalized white supremacy by supporting that lying narrative that we own and sold our own people. Stop feeding into that. We're talking about a monstrous thing that lies on impulse.